hello and welcome back to the another video of excel macros and in this excel macro video we will understand how to read pdf using excel macro first we will see the excel macro code to read the pdf line by line and then in the second part of the video we will see excel macro code to read pdf word by word and before i start i request you to hit the like button if you like the content of this video subscribe to the channel for more automation videos and share the feedback in the comment all right so i will go to my folder directly so this is just a simple pdf which i have taken from one of my video description so here is the excel now i will just go here and click view code i will go to tools first of all references few of the required things are already selected now we have to just go and select microsoft word it can be 6 14 15 or any other version based on your excel version so don't worry much about that and i will just uh, minimize the size so that i can show you parallelly what is happening in the excel let's keep the excel this side this side so as first part what we will do is we will try to read the entire document one time and then display the content of it in a message box so right now on your screen you can see the code to read the entire content of the word document in the file name what we are doing that we are using the ms word library to read the pdf document in excel macros you can utilize the ms word library to read pdf all right so let's uh, read this file now and display the result in a message box so you can see the pdf now here and you can see the content in the message box and this is the pdf file all right now next step so we want to read this line by line so now we will not use this word doc content rather we will use the paragraphs so i'll just minimize the size also and move this document little here so now instead of displaying in the message box what we are going to do we will so from wherever it is starting we will keep moving one cell down and then we will write the data here I am adding one line, this workbook dot sheet one. So my sheet one is sheet one. You can use your sheet name here. I will be selecting A1 first and from there we will start. All right, so let's run this now. You can have a look on the sheet also. I'll go up so you can see all the data has been read by the Excel macro and mentioned in the Excel cells. Now next is like if you want to read each of this one word into a single cell then how will you do that? So now we have to loop on, so I will read this data before I run this once again. And I will set the width as well to the normal one. Okay, so now what we have to do is we have to read each word in this paragraph. So for that what I will do, I will just delete these lines. And from here you can see on your screen right now we are starting a new loop so i will explain you line by line so what we are doing we are reading each word in the paragraph and then we are looping on that we are setting the cell offset by one column before we were setting the cell offset by one row Alright, you can go backward in the video and you can check that part. So once we have completed writing all the words, we have to move in the next line of Excel. So for that, what we are doing, whichever is the Excel cell, we are moving to plus one row and a cell. Alright, so I'll just 
run it in front of you now. So it has said focus on one and then it is a, it has a starting writing the data. Okay, so data is written. Now let's match this with the PDF. All right, so I'll just display this entire code on your screen. You can have a look and you can write, you can do replace or you can do whatever you want in this area. You can share your feedback in comments and you can write if you have any question. Please subscribe to the channel for more and more videos. Don't do the copy paste of the code. Please try something from your side as well so that you can have good hands on macro. Try to replace some part of the cell. Try to add some more part of the cell. And try to give some column names. And if you don't know how to do all that, so if you don't know how to do all that, go through the go through my channel and you will find many more videos on excel macros and python automation thank you very much for